Hey nerd fighters, what's up? It's Nathan. I am really excited right now because I've never done this before. This has been one take week where we make a video in just one take and I've never done that. If you watch my videos, it's pretty obvious that I kind of heavily rely on the the cut, video cut, editing. Um, I like to cut out a lot of times where I'm just like spacing out, just you know, wasting time. But I can't do that. I hit play, I'm gonna go for a few minutes until we hit play again. One take. And with one take, I think that kind of implies your first take. I know there's been some maybe a little debate about this, <clears throat> Kevin. <laughs> who said that, you know, as long as your your final take is in one take, it doesn't necessarily matter if it was your first take, which I understand. Like, technically your 50th take is still just one take, but you had a bunch before that. Like, like if, if you eat 20 cookies, and someone was like, how many cookies did you have? And you were like, I had one cookie. You're not lying, you did have one cookie, you just also had 19 other cookies. <laughs> so... That's a weird analogy. Kevin, however, gets a free pass um, because he showed us the times he messed up from his other videos and they were hilarious. Like the very end when he just paused in the middle of a sentence and yelled and threw his camera across the room. Priceless. Maybe I'll end this video that way. Hopefully it doesn't go bad, but I don't know. We'll see. So, one take video. I just realized, though, that I haven't done the intro. So, we should probably watch the intro together that way, I, we can prove that it's all been in one take. So that's a great idea. Let's watch the intro together. And... go. There I was. Nathan! Oh, the nerd oh, fighters! I love that intro. Don't you love that intro? We all look so cute. Dave did a good job of putting that together. I think Dave did. Dave, maybe he had help. I shouldn't have said anything. Now I feel bad. Okay, this video does need to have a point, so let's get on with it. Um, I picked probably the worst possible time to do this. I'm a huge KU fan. I live in Lawrence, Kansas. University of Kansas. Went there. It's my alma mater. Huge fan. KU, really awesome at basketball. In fact, our school is kind of where basketball was, like, first existed. James Naismith at KU, Fog Allen, first ever basketball coach at KU. Pretty epic. So, needless to say, March Madness is kind of my favorite time of the year. And usually March Madness lasts for a month, the month of March. However, about an hour ago, KU got knocked out of the NCAA tournament. Shortening my favorite month of the year to one weekend. Ugh, really sucks. Really bummed out about it. But I'm trying to forget about all that and just be in a happy place and make this video for my friends who I love. Speaking of which, last week the theme was making videos for other people. And man, am I bummed out that I didn't have a video to make that week. But I was so flattered. Well, first off, I thought it was a great idea. Everyone got to make videos for each of us and make each other feel really great, which was awesome. A couple people mentioned me, Kevin mentioned, Kevin and Dave mentioned, or no, Kevin mentioned me and Dave in his video, and I was super flattered. Kevin, you're awesome. Don't, uh, don't downplay your quality. With, with only being able to use a, um, webcam and two lights, I mean, when Rose and I first started, we had a DSLR camera, and I think that your video still looked better than then, because we had the equipment, we just didn't really know how to use it. So it's more important to know how to use what you have than to have equipment that you don't really use as well, I guess. Am I really at four minutes already? This cannot be possible. Well, running out of time pretty quickly here. Um, so yeah, last week's topic was awesome. Next week's topic, stronger. I just wanted to say real quick, I'm excited about this for the inspirational aspect. I like the idea of seeing where my friends maybe had faults or something went wrong and they were able to overcome it and become stronger, better people. I like the inspiration aspect. I'm a little worried that this week's theme is gonna make for a kind of slew of bummer videos, but to you people making videos this week, it can be a bummer at first, but let's really try to drive that inspirational aspect and make it a good, you know, important video at the end. Also, this week, secret surprise guest who will be showing up later this week. I'm running out of time. I gotta go. DFTBA. Connor, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.